Cage got no cheese. This why I do I throw cheese. I won't even look at you. I walk in the morning, I pick at you. <laughs> yo, yo, yo. Yo, bird back with another video today. I hope you're all doing good. I hope you're all doing well. I hope that you're flipping weeks been good and your previous week and the year before that the year before that and the year before that and the year before that one and the year before that one which is back in the future aka consulting with your past <laughs> so as i can say them ones there the ones that do love going to the gym i cut for you this one's for you huh? this for me look yeah when we go to the gym for example, I'm going to say Pure Gym because this happens at Pure Gym 24-7. There's times in a day where it's packed. Sometimes where it's like dead or packed. Mainly in Pure Gym, it's going to be packed around half four onwards to about half nine. Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, Thursdays. Those times are normally flipping packed with people. And especially if you want to do legs or you want to do a specific machine, you go there, you're like, oh, machine, I don't want to have to wait. I don't have to sit there and be like, hey, excuse me, boss, uh, are you done with your set? And then the Don's obviously gonna be like, oh yeah, man's got two sets left, mate. It's like, man, I don't wanna have to wait. And when you wait, you ain't do nothing. You pretend to do some neck stretches that you don't wanna do. Or you end up going to a machine and you're sat there, you're like, bruv, I'm not even training this today. You're doing legs and you're training chest. It's like, I don't wanna get on this machine, but it's taking too long. Damn dons, I can't stand it. I can't stand waiting. Or when you go to a machine and you just enter the gym, you see it's free, you're like, yes, that's my machine, yes. You walk up to the machine and someone don takes it. I'll be like, get out my face. That's my machine. I spotted it when I got here and then as soon as I wanted it, you want it now, huh? That is not fair. That's my machine. <laughs> this fucking mine, dude. Fair. Dude, that's my machine. That kind of a little bit coulda, coulda, shoulda looks like this. Uh, uh, uh. Section out, you know what I'm saying, bruh. Huh? Bruh. Bruh, bruh. It's flipping out. How the fuck is he on this? this better stay there, Nigel. Stay there. You wanna play this game, do you? Huh? Ah. Huh? Uh, wait, how do you just get on that one? What? What? How? He was just. He was just on that. inspiration on you lot listen okay just like at the gym or just like at uni it's good to have goals okay uh, it's lovely to have dreams it's lovely lovely to have big dreams I want to have one million subscribers big dreams however you need to have goals goals to lead you to those dreams because dreams without goals or goals without dreams is 
pointless. For example, when you're doing homework, if you look at the grand scheme of things, the whole project, or whatever you have to do at home, you're going to be like, ah, oh, fuck this, I can't do this because it's too much. But if you break it in sections, then you complete the task. That's what goals is for your whole entire dream. No, that's goals for your leading up to your dream. That's what it is. So it's like, okay, so 1 million, yeah? 500, 1,000, 10,000, 500,000 and so on so on. You catch the drift, yeah? You need goals, okay? Whether it's in church, you need goals to get close to Jesus, you need goals for that. You need goals for everything, okay? Make sure you have goals, lead up to your dreams, when trying to get closer to God, trying to read the Bible, in anything you, you're trying to do, uni, college, school, Reckon a fucking doo man. You need some goals. And this is so for me too. So make sure you write down some goals that lead to that dream. Try to stick to it. Follow it. Do things that will achieve it. And instead of going out and fighting all the time, go try and do that. Or instead of going out with your friends all the time, try and do that. And that's something I need to take for my own advice. Do you like, subscribe and share to your friends because man's need the help. Man, when I get to 1,000 subscribers, I'm gonna try for January to get 1,000 subscribers, and then from there make a new goal. Share, subscribe. God bless. Spread peace, not hate. Your boys out. Peace.